Now let's turn our focus back to the closing ceremony of the Olympics. Tens of thousands of people gathered at the Pyeongchang Olympic Stadium on Sunday night to bid farewell to the 2018 Winter Games. It was quite the show in terms of visuals and music and there was a party atmosphere in the air as the hard work was done and the, the athletes and all those involved in making the Games a success could finally let their hair down a bit. Uh, Wang Zhonghuan reports. 17 thrilling days of sport in Pyeongchang and the sub-host city of Gangneung came to an end on Sunday night, where it all started a couple weeks prior, the Pyeongchang Olympic Stadium. The ceremony started with the stadium drenched in light and the crowd counting down to the start of the fun. Under the theme of a celebration of future and the spirit of adventure, there was a mixture of traditional and contemporary Korean culture on display. Among the highlights, Former 21 singer CL and boy band EXO took the stage to thank the athletes for their hard work with a thundering performance. The crowd let out a huge roar when the athletes entered the stadium, but the biggest cheer was reserved for the South Korean and North Korean teams, who again entered the stadium together. Unlike the opening ceremony, this time they waved their respective national flags and wore their national uniforms, the South Koreans clad in white and the North Koreans in red. Continuing the goodwill of the Games, the North Koreans also held the Korean unification flag as they made their way around the stadium. The closing ceremony attracted more than 35,000 spectators, including President Moon Jae-in, who watched the ceremony in the VIP box with Ivanka Trump, the U.S. president's first daughter, Kim Young-chul, a vice chair of the North Korean ruling party's Central Committee, and Chinese Vice Premier Liu Yandong. The Pyeongchang Games officially ended, with the traditional raising of the Greek flag, lowering of the Olympic flag, and the Beijing 2022 flag handover ceremony. The Olympic flag that fluttered for over 17 days at the Olympic Stadium in Pyeongchang was handed over to Chen Jining, the mayor of Beijing, for the next Winter Games in four years' time. The Olympic flame was also extinguished, but this isn't the end. The Pyeongchang Winter Paralympic Games will start on March 9th and run for 10 days. Wang Zhongwan, Arirang News.